Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's go over units of measurements used to measure weight in the United States. To begin with, weight is how heavy something is. It's a measure of the force of gravity acting on an object. There are at least three common units used to measure weight. Up first is the ounce. An ounce weighs roughly what a pencil weighs. A single slice of bread also weighs about an ounce. So if you had three pencils and two slices of bread, you would have roughly five ounces. The abbreviation OZ is used as an abbreviation with ounce. 16 ounces make up a pound. A loaf of bread weighs roughly a pound. A football weighs about a pound, and a soccer ball weighs roughly a pound. The abbreviation LB is used for pounds. Now, what do you do if you have something heavy like a car or a train? You could use what's called a short ton, which is equal to 2,000 pounds. It uses the abbreviation either TN or ST. A small car weighs roughly one ton. An adult female elephant weighs roughly three or four tons. Now, let's complete a couple of conversions between these different units of weight. First, Adam's new truck weighs five tons. How many pounds does this truck weigh? Well, since there's 2,000 pounds in a ton, we will just go five times 2,000 which is equal to 10,000 pounds. How many pounds are found in 48 ounces? There are 16 ounces in a pound, so you take 48 and divide it by 16, and you get 3 pounds. Bob removed the tire from his car, and it weighs 6 pounds. How many ounces does his tire weigh? Because there are 16 ounces in a pound, you can multiply 6 times 16. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.